Good morning. This is Hi. quite the sight to come out to. Yeah. It's beautiful out too. It is. I'm just relaxing. Ready to hit the road. So we're gonna do breakfast and a little stroll before we go. Guys, we couldn't find Stacy. It was very sad. We didn't talk about it for a long time. And then I, while Peter was home last night with Eve, I really like I scrolled all of the channels. I think it's just Saratoga. Yeah, I don't know. I mean it might just be a when, resort. When it, really, resort. when it first happened, the must do Disney channel is still called Must Do Disney which is like channel like four or five, but then channel 73 is Must Do Disney Spanish. When they switched off Stacy on the regular Must Do Disney, they switched the Must Do Disney Spanish to the Must Do Disney English. And even as, as recently as last week when our friends were at Animal Kingdom Lodge, it was there, but today it's not. It's something yeah. else now and we couldn't find her, so. Hopefully it's a resort by resort basis. But it and she'll really come back. Because maybe that means that she's not coming back. I just feel like a lot of what she says is like not relevant with the restrictions of right, COVID. Like no fast pass. Half the things are closed forever. Half the things are closed temporarily. Right. So. But we got to go to, we're packed up. Mm. We're not going to, with our stroll that we're going to do, we're not going to be able to make it back before checkout. Yeah. So we're going to drop our stuff off at the car. I'm so excited to use our stroller as like, like a, like a, like a bellhop <laughs> cart. Another thing I've wanted to do my whole life. Right. Our food has arrived or I went and got it. Cinnamon roll, delicious. Chocolate croissant, delicious. These potato wedges, and this is the plant-based egg and cheese sandwich, breakfast sandwich. We've got some roasted red peppers, some spinach, um, and then vegan cheese and egg. Looks really good. I'm rocking a coffee still. Sarah's rocking an apple juice. James is rocking a potential nap. Yeah. So I created like the spicy Kenyan Githri on quinoa situation. I didn't put any corn in it. I didn't have like the correct like carrots for the slaw. Um, but I found a recipe online. I'll link it below. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. We've it had smells a, delicious. Yeah, we've had a nice productive afternoon. Target run, vlog editing, Mr. Man is snoozing. We gotta get going after this dinner. Mm-hmm. We got plans tonight. Oh my goodness. Ah! We are here. We're here and we're happy, but we're also in a little bit of a rush. The tree, our first our this, first sighting. This is my favorite in park tree. We we're gonna we're gonna come back later and appreciate it more, but we only have like 30 minutes to get to America Pavilion to see the Voice of Liberty sing some Christmas carols. So excited. But we gotta go. So this must have to do with something about one of the new like hide and seek things or like maps that you can get, but up here, so there's an Olaf. I'm not sure what that is in front of him, but I think it's a new like you gotta go find the Olafs all around the World Showcase. All I wanted to do this evening was see the Voices of Liberty Christmas carols. We made it to the last show. It was looking bleak, but we got lucky with I-4, and we got lucky with a seat. Mariachi Cobra just ended their last show. Um, and we have a bench, and if, if, our, if your baby is sleeping, you can keep your stroller with you with those, these back benches. So, our baby's currently sleeping. So we're staying at the back benches. were the first 
to kiss under the mistletoe. In Japan, they light bonfires on Mount Fuji to welcome the winter solstice. And Jewish families around the world celebrate Hanukkah with age-old traditions of lighting the menorah, eating latkes, and spinning the dreidel. food out with the holiday pot pie. It's plant-based. Wow, wow. Voices of Liberty, especially holiday edition, never get old. And now we're getting the holiday pot pie from the American Pavilion, which is actually a plant-based option. But look at this tree. Look at this. Second best tree in Epcot. Oh my, this is plant-based jackfruit. Delicious. Look how crispy that top looks. This looks better than the one we got from Mark and So. So it seems the sights and sounds of Mariachi Cobra swoons James because he slept through all Voices of Liberty. But right when we got this little corner spot hidden, on the, hidden away on the side of uh, Voice or the American Pavilion, we looked at James and his eyes were just wide open. Listen to Mariachi Cobra. Oh, he's doing. He does so many stretches when he wakes up. Seven hundred stretches. Oh, into another one. So this is really good. I really like it. It is more earthy, mushroomy if you're not into that sort of thing, but I enjoy it. Watching some poop out. <laughs> Just being honest. Nothing like Sarah watching some tutorials in the middle of uh, Epcot by Germany. We tried putting James in the carrier that, that Sarah used yesterday. And, uh, um, Peter. We don't know if uh, we just weren't doing it right or if he was just fighting it today because yeah. he likes to stretch his legs out. Yeah, we're learning. But, but I'm just like a problem solver, so it's like frustrating. But I think I think I figured out what we need to do better next time. Next time. But I think it's also been like 40 minutes of us trying now. <laughs> it's not been that long. It feels like it. Yeah. And he's frustrated. Yeah. And he's just ready to be chill. And I don't want to put him just so we can carry him. We'll get him calm, we'll get him back in the bassinet, and he'll be loving some World Showcase. We're back in Germany, so I could pick up this cider that's from St. Pete's, but it's an apple cinnamon cider at the Germany booth. Really good. So our next stop is La Triumph, and we are getting a couple of items from here. Here's the full menu. It's really cool that their latkes are plant-based, even the sour cream. And I also know that the black and white cookie is plant-based. So a pastrami on rye. Some latkes. Oh wait, some more latkes. Oh wait, another pastrami, right? A donut. It's a jelly filled donut. And a cookie. Oh my goodness, what a feast. I think I figured out something that was upsetting him and it was my big Santa hat and ears. Now he's just been like sitting staring at me longingly. Sarah, how is it so far? This, this really is good. the pastrami on rice scratch on the itch of Sarah's for like probably two months I think you've wanted Basically it. somebody feed Phil. Yeah, ever Last since then, time we watched that. You've wanted a pastrami and rye. This is how you have cat festival. You feel so satisfied. And then afterwards I pick up the crumbs, I drop on him. There's a little snack after. The UK has just been slacking for the festivals, the past couple of festivals. Yeah. There's been no booths here. Nope. Look at this beauty. We're headed out. We had to give the tree some appreciation at nighttime. This 
is the aftermath of a proper Epcot night. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> He's so our child yeah. with that open mouth. And open eyes. They, they just closed. <laughs> For our la our latest track record, this is very early, but we're going to bed now. Here is the quote for the day. Cannot believe there's only one more day left in November. Today is November 29th. Bit of a long run by Thomas Dreer. The world is a great mirror. It reflects back to you what you are. If you are loving, if you are friendly, if you are helpful, the world will prove loving and friendly and helpful to you. The world is what you are. Oh, I could. It's one of my favorite ones of this entire two year calendar. Tomorrow officially goes back to work. I mean, I've been working like maintenance data stuff, but like tomorrow's like work, work. Getting droopy. She's droopy. <laughs> Mr. She Man is all comfy on his pillow, but I'm gonna give him his little snack before bed and head to sleep. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.